Okay, what we've done here is access the wall by drilling a two inch hole and actually we can get in and see how much insulation is existing in there. You reach in and, and feel around and there's a full bat of insulation in the wall here so there probably isn't going to be any payback to trying to add any more insulation. Uh, if you get into the wall cavity and there's any kind of a gap at all, it probably will pay back to do some dense packing or get some, some type of insulation you know, added in there. Uh, this would be pretty much a standard R11 installation. So, uh. And if somebody's looking, Bruce, they, you know, if they're looking to buy a house and they can't be drilling holes in a wall, they could maybe pull off an uh, inspection right. plate as long as the power's off to that. They can kind of look around the edge of that and see if there's insulation in that way. Right, yeah. Any, any way you can, the, there's a lot of different ways to, to access. Um, another good one is on this house, for example, you saw on the outside it's got vinyl siding. Vinyl siding actually unsnaps real easy, so you can lift a piece of that up and drill a hole under there. So uh, you don't have to do it where it's going to show up all the time, but it, there are ways to access to check the insulation. Mm -hmm.